everybody and welcome back. Got a song today I've had lots and lots of requests for, but today we're going to do a warm-up and do a quick tongue twister warm-up. And it's one we've done lots and lots of times. So it's Sally Saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. So some of you have done it lots of times with me. Sally Saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. And the key to it, remember two things, don't make the S's too long. Don't try and go, Sally Saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers. And when you get to the side by side at the end, make the last side quick. Don't sing side by side with a long I in there, but side by side, side by side. So really click the ending. Sally Saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. And then there's time to breathe before the next one. Ready? Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucers side by side. So now quickly, now quickly. So. Lots and lots of little movement. Don't clench. Not at all. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. And I wouldn't breathe. Don't breathe between every single one. You'll end up sort of hyperventilating. But you know, between every two or three, however many is comfortable. But really quick. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. You know, lots and lots of movement in the face. There. It's a free facelift. This one's brilliant for wrinkles. Sally saw well, brilliant against wrinkles. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Ready? Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. Sally saw Sylvester stacking silver saucer side by side. So as I said, so I've had lots and lots of requests for. Um, it's the Lord bless you and keep you. Um, now before people, some of you are going, oh that's really high, I'm going to do it actually quite low. So yes, normally, normally we do it quite a lot higher than this because the sopranos are soaring, you know, all the way up there. But we're going to do it at a reasonable pitch so everyone will be able to sing the tune all the way through. And it's one of these ones, it's just about shaping of the lines, beautifully written tune, like, like so much rutter stuff. You know, the, the tune, um, tune and the lyrics and words really fit together beautifully and he understands the shaping of what's a nice line to sing. So it's a lovely tune. The Lord bless you, And you know, it's in naturally, naturally lilts. Don't don't bounce up. The Lord bless, but the Lord bless you and keep you. So it's aim for keep, and then the Lord make his face to shine. And that jump up and shine is really clever. The Lord make his face to shine shine. Not shine, not shine. I bet. Think of an A. Shine upon you. Then he does it a second time. To shine upon you and be gracious. But don't breathe off the second upon you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you. Breath to shine upon you and be gracious. Then breathe and be gracious unto you. And he lied there. Not be gracious unto you. Yep. And be gracious unto you. So a little crescendo through. Gracious unto you. So let's do that all together. From the beginning. Just a little bit richer. The Lord, lots of support from it. Not the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord bless you and keep you. So really rich. The Lord make His face to shine upon you, to shine upon you and be gracious and be gracious unto you. So it's really got really quite sort of. You know, warm and rich there. <clears throat> and then start quietly. So we've got this lovely next phrase coming out. The Lord lift up the light. The Lord lift up the light. You know how much I like a l on things. And you're aiming for light. The Lord lift up the la light. So dip thumb at the end. The Lord lift up the light. Yeah, and you can sneak a breath there. If you want to, you can sneak a breath. If you can do it all in one, only one breath, the whole phrase. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance up. Then fine, do it only one breath. 
If you need to sneak one, sneak it right at the end of light. So quite a vicious it. The Lord lift up the light of his cow. So it doesn't interrupt the words. So really that line and the Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you. And a countenance. Cow not countenance, but countenance. And then the next one, the Lord lift up the light. So it's repeating the words and it goes higher, so even more on that one. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance. And this one goes back up upon you. So the first one stays low. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you. Then the second one higher. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance. Upon you. But just as you get to that pon you, just tail off on it. Don't sing you, don't know you with one of those ones. Pon you. And put a little w at the end. So let's do the two. The Lord do. give you peace and these have to tail off so don't go too quiet too quickly so the first one still quite rich and give you a peace and lean on the first one peace and give you a peace and then the second one bit quieter and give you a peace <coughs> excuse me then the third one really quiet and give you a peace <coughs> Excuse me. Um, okay, for the third one, slightly different. So the first one, and give you a peace. Second one, the same one note lower, and give you a peace. But the third one, and give you, goes all the way back up to that note, and give you a peace. And then, and give you a peace. Now, if we were doing this in parts, Sopranos would then go peace. They do that, but it actually overlaps with the amens. So because we're all doing the tune, when you do the last one, and give you a peace. So do three beats on it, and then breathe on the fourth beat, and give you a peace. Ready for the. So let's do the and give you a peace of so those three. So a bit stronger, a bit stronger than you'd naturally do it on the first one. So you've got somewhere to go. If you start too quiet, there's then nowhere to tail off. So and give you and go. And give you a peace. 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 And then it's just the armament, and these are a huge build up. So it's. So ah, armer. Yeah, not don't think armen. So an open ah. And grow through the long note. Armen. Little flick end. Don't close your mouth for men, but men. So your tongue goes up, root them out behind the teeth. Men. And everything is in the right position for breathing. So the amens go. Amen. 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 Difficulty really, obviously it's not the words. Well it is the words, because it's knowing where the R's and the men's go. So the first ones are easy. Amen. Amen. And then Amen. Uh -huh. So that one comes in a bit quicker. Amen. 
and that I think is the really unexpected one. Four whole beats on that one. Please don't, please don't do a bad parish church choir job on me. Don't go, men. Please don't do that before the last one. So, men. And there, just sing through the me, the N of men. Men. So let's do the amens. So really, ah, and you've got to really go for it. It's all building up for that top note. Ah, 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 men. Ah, 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 men. Ah, it's going for that one. That's the highest point. That's the loudest point in the whole thing. So really, ah, men. And if at the very end, I'll give you as many of the amens as I can. If you watch what I'm going to do, men. So watch that, that means closing it. Men. And then you bring it off. Little flick, don't do a vicious men. No. Don't do a no at the end of it. But it just tails off. Men. And then wait to nothing. So all the way through from the beginning. Well, I hope you've enjoyed today's song. As ever, please do send me any comments or suggestions. Take care. See you soon.